All right, welcome back. And this was always one of my favorite games as well. This game did not age well. This is gonna be terrible. This is this is actually a very hard game. A lot of the Mario's on the Game Boy were the first one I beat, and I might I may I may eventually go through it. But I feel like this one was actually harder. The bosses were were pretty unique for the stand edge. And this was the introduction of one of my favorite Mario characters. Mario. When he was a pure bad guy. Yeah, the Game Boy versions changed everything. Instead of an extra mushroom, it was a heart that was an extra man. That was halfway point, by the way. Yeah, it had. Kind of like Super Mario World there. Oh, also your bullets. You can break them. All, oh, no. That, okay, only in the first one. In the uh, original Mario World, or Mario Land on Game Boy, your uh, bullets would actually pick up points. And in some areas, it was the only way to get certain points. No, it's been a long time. Now, on each level, there's a bell. That's your special exit. And then you have your little mini game. Ah. I'll take it. I think this is like a feather. It's been a while. It's like a feather. It's supposed to be a carrot. Okay. So you had, you had a lot of freedom in this game. Decide where you wanted to go. Uh, you needed six co uh, coins to get in here. Um, and there is six areas with a couple levels and a boss. There's not a lot of levels in the areas, but they can be a pain in the... So this is tree zone. We're gonna start here. I don't know if it's correct. This is blind, so understand I'm going to die a lot. This might become a terrible, terrible let's play. I'm okay with that. Oh, oh, that was crap. Oh, and and again. Look at the Sonic wanna be. Please be a mushroom. I think if you're shrunk when you hit that, it'll automatically give you a it'll automatically give you a, a it'll, it'll make you grow. I don't want to find out yet. Okay. 
don't really care about that, but I'll take it. I will be trying to get all of these exits. <laughs> I make no promises. Oh my lord. Oh no. Alright, got it. <laughs> what they do. Uh, I think it's supposed to be like, honey, don't ask me what the hell that was, because I don't have an answer. It's like a milk, it's like a cowfish. Is that a thing? <laughs> so it slows you down. Um, there's not so much a problem when you have a fireball can be very problematic when you don't. I think some of these fall too. Not the worst thing he's ever climbed through, huh? Alright, got the first bell. You're supposed to flap your ears and land on those things. Uh, I'm not going that way, because I can easily admit I'm not that good. Oh, that's nice to know they turn into bombs. These remind me of. You remember the in Mario 3 the ghost house with the little white the booze on the oh my god, come on. Okay, this is not as hard as it looks. Remember the it was they were like little white platforms that the booze would come out of the tops and bottoms of? That's what it reminds me of. Harder than it looks. Got it. <laughs> I 
and I'm going to end it here. See you next time.